Hi, my name is Devon Best, and I'm a professional football player at the wide receiver position. Today's tip is how to beat man-to-man -man press. We're going to start with my friend Dion coming on out to join me. What's up, man? How you doing? The key to beating press man-to-man -man is always, first and foremost, having an attitude. It's a mindset. So you have to go in expecting to win. You can't go in thinking, okay, this is a great DB. He's going to beat me, regardless of who he is. You have to go in with the mindset saying you're going to beat him no matter how he's playing you, no matter how big he is, how fast he is, you're going to win. And the key to everything also is being patient. We're going to line the football up right there to my left. So again, you want to have your left foot up, your right foot back. You want to be in a nice, balanced, stable position. That way you have time to elude your defender. So the first move we're going to work on is called the speed rush. This is for DBs who are really, really aggressive and who wants to jump you at the line of scrimmage and want to be physical with you and make sure you can't get off the line. So the first thing I'm going to do, when a quarterback says hike, I'm going to attack the defender to see what his next move is. Now, when I attack him, Dion's going to come straight for me and try to take me off the line of scrimmage. So when I say go, Dion, come at me. Ready, go. My next move is to get my hand combat, get my hands up, and I'm going to elude him by speed releasing. Now, you get some DBs that are really, really, really good and really tricky that likes to switch it up and go back and forth. So let's say he didn't press me, or let's say he didn't want to be real aggressive and physical with me. I'm going to stay at the line of scrimmage, and when I say hike, Dion, you're just going to stay there and chatter your feet and then come after me. So ready, go. I'm going to chatter my feet and then make my move on them and get up the field. So to take you all over again, I'm going to go back to the first one. The first one is the speed release. The speed release is for guys who are really, really physical, really aggressive, and um, quite frankly, don't, have, don't, don't really have the control that, that you have. So you want to make sure you beat him at his own game. So when you, when you say hike or when a quarterback says hike and he wants to jump you, you want to be ready to slip him by and get right up the field. Taking it back, now if you got a DB that's a lot more patient and want to kind of see, kind of feel you out, see what you want to do, the key to that is being patient. You want to make your move right in front of him. That way I can get through him. You don't want to make your move all the way back here because you're not covering any ground. You're standing in the same place. So you want to make sure every time you do it, you're coming up attacking him and then making it missed and stand straight up. Last and but not least, the next move is called the, the double jab move. Now you want to make sure that obviously you're in a proper football position, you're in a good stance to where you know, you're able to be limber and be able to bounce off your right foot or left foot. This is for guys who are really, really patient. So. When I go up to the line of scrimmage, just stay there, D. Now, when I go up to the line of scrimmage, I'm coming up, I'm thinking about giving him a move. I'm going to give him the move, and then I'm going to come back out this way. Now, let's say he's not going for none of that. So just, just mirror me, Dion. So I'm going to come up. One, two. He's still on me. He's still on me. See? Now, that's you get good DBs that's in the uh, National Football League, that's in the NCAA that does that. They sit back and they wait for your move the whole time. So this move is designed for guys like that. So just follow me, Dion. So I'm going to come up to him. I'm going to shake him this way, shake him this way, and run that way. Now I'm back this way again, and now I'm off to the release. I gave him a double jab move. So And that complements the speed rush. That complements just the regular stick and go. It compli the best thing about all these moves, they complement one another. So I'm gonna try that, I'm gonna do that one more time. This is called the double jab move. So you wanna come up, bam, bam, stick them and get right up the field and get onto your route. I'm Devon Best and that's your pro tip for the day.